Hey, what's up, fellow YouTubers? This is Starscream1988, or better known as Odie to all my friends out there. So, we have another Captain America here today. This is number three in the series, deluxe version. This is the Power Shield launcher cap. And, um, like I said before in the previous video, I, I really don't like the gimmicky stuff, but, um, again, it being a Hasbro property, it has its nostalgia, and it's... I guess it just stems towards, um, I'm a big G.I. Joe um, fan out there, um, as, as a lot of people are, but um, let's check this guy out, okay, so again, standard packaging, no big deal, um, Chris Evans on the cover, this is part of the comic series, so it does not have his likeness, um, comes with the it's Captain America. He has a uh, some sort of rifle. Uh, pretty cool backpack, um, and he doesn't actually carry a shield. But if you look to the right of the package here, these are disc launchers, and um, I guess um, it shoots it out, and we'll find out when we open them up. But um, yeah, you know they're again standard packaging. Nothing, nothing crazy. Number three in the series. Um, I, I I saw number one and he had some green camel and some other stuff and I don't know if there's actually let me move that again. See if he's back here. Yeah, he has like a red um kind of like a red looking vest and something else, but he was just really ugh. And there was quite a few of the single figures. There was um Winter Soldier is out too and he comes with like a backpack and stuff, but again I just wasn't that interested. Um I think like everybody else, I'm waiting for the crossbones. <laughs> so um, that that should be pretty cool. And I'm sure he'll be the short pack. But um, yeah, so let's open this guy up. So here he is without the package. Out of the package, I should say. Um, again, I, I really like this figure. I, again, I, I keep emphasizing, I don't like the gimmicks. But I just like this. Um, maybe it's like the nostalgic thing with... You know, me being a big G.I. Joe fan, um, it just looks like, you know, it's like something General Hawk would have worn. I think it was um, the second or third General Hawk, or maybe it actually was the second General Hawk. Um, he came with his backpack that, you know, he could fly and whatever. So I just kind of like, you know, I, I think a lot of people out there like jets and, you know, we can't fly. So it, imagination wise, it's cool. But um, here's the um, one of the discs. It comes with two of them. And like I said, yeah, he can't hold them. It's just a you know regular round disc. So um, here's the figure. Now, note, I actually had to use a Captain America stand here. I know I just took Captain America off the camera, but I had to use this because he's so top heavy that he just won't stand. But you know, I think actually, wow, that's I, I didn't even really try that, and it actually worked. Um, but I think on, on a norm, if you try to pose him, it won't work. I think I just got him in a real good pose, and hopefully he'll stay that way. But, um, yeah, he's it's pretty top-heavy. So, um, yeah, see, just he just won't hold. But anyway, um, here are the, the, the two guns. Originally, I had said that I only saw one in the package. One's kind of hiding, but it is two guns. He can't hold them, though, because uh, as I opened up the package, I, I tried it, and it just... It's pretty impossible. Like I said, I mean, I just would never pose Cap with a gun. I have nothing against guns because actually I, I, I do like guns, but just not on Captain America. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm not even going to bother with those. But, um, so that's the backpack. Well, his jetpack, I should say. Um, and again, it comes with a gimmick. You just push that and it just fires. It's pretty cool. The kids will love it. I mean,. Whoever designed it knew what he was doing, so <laughs> so that's that. Um, he comes with a peg on the back of him, right there. And so if you look at the backpack, there is a peg right there. And obviously you know, it has the shoulder straps, or shoulder hooks I should say, so it holds well. Um, the missiles don't come out, so they're fixed there. So if the little, if, young, if the younger tots buy this, um, They'll more than likely probably break them, but you know who knows. Um, us collectors, we know we just display them, um, and it hooks right back pretty easy. 
So, um, standard, just like the parachute version that I just did a a, a review on. Um, it has that kind of like, you know, has that motion there, uh, which is I think kind of cool. Um, knees, the feet don't move. Now I know a lot of people out there like the pivoting feet. I I personally don't. Um, never have. It, it is cool. But um, I just don't like it because when you want to stand them, they usually fall over or you have to find the right pose. Again, you know, he's a little tough because he's top heavy. But um, I, I don't I don't like pivoting feet personally. So, but anyway, um, his elbows move. Um, his neck, obviously, 360. Little exorcist there. <laughs> uh, he does not look up or down, but whatever, doesn't matter. And um, it's exact same scope as the parachute version. Um, for those of you that did not see that review, um, this is the MU version of Cap. And as you can see, he is thinner than this Cap. This guy is a little bit bulkier, not as thin. Um, I think he's better proportion, but that's just my opinion. I think this guy's really cool. He has an awesome belt there. He has the pockets in the boots. I mean, I know this is based off of Ultimate, so. Um, but yeah, so it's a, it's it's a little it's pretty different, you know. Same family, Marvel U, but you know, different scope. So um, here he's actually with Archangel, just so you can see the depth of his wings. So for those of you that have Archangel, so yeah, so that's that. And um, here's a little comparison, so you can see what he would look like with the other different size caps. Here's the 8 inch, and here is the 12 inch, and move the camera up there a little, so as you can see. But yeah, it's a pretty cool figure. Um, they should be out by Monday the 16th. I just got lucky. I mean, I don't know if all toy stores are going to be having them out now. But I'm here in um, Massachusetts and my local toy store had it. So yeah, I mean, picked them up. So hope you enjoyed the review. Hope it's, um, you know, something that you might want to pick up. I do recommend them. I think he's cool. Um... But yeah, that's um, Captain America with his glider jetpack. Cool. Thanks for watching.